The other day I uh, made a video talking about how there's these bots going around um, spamming people's comments saying that MMIW is a scam or that it's a cult and um, they have a specific hashtag attached to it. And if you put that hashtag into the search, you will find all the videos that have responded to it. And on some of them, if you click on the comments, it leads you back to their pages. Some of those pages have content and some of them don't. And then if you also Google that hashtag, you will also find the Instagram pages, the Facebook pages, and the YouTube pages with certain propaganda. And let me show you the propaganda that they're pushing on these pages. I crossed out certain words so I don't get any CGVs, but this is the type of crap that they're pushing out there. Here's one of their so-called memes of information. Here is another one. Does this start to look familiar to you? Hmm. Notice how it says to blame oil workers. And here's another one. Same thing. These are bot farms and it looks like it's big oil that are pushing these bot farms out and this propaganda. And some of you may wonder, what does big oil have to do with this? It has everything to do with the man camps. Near these oil fields, which happens to be around a lot of these reservations, where a lot of these indigenous women go missing. They are trying to deflect away from what is happening, remove themselves from responsibility and accountability. And this is why I made my video the other day to encourage people to stop responding to the comments through videos. Block them and delete them. Because otherwise we're sending traffic to these hashtags and these pages, which pushes this propaganda and they're utilizing us to push their hashtags for them.